on BBC Two and iPlayer. Hello, very good afternoon to you. You're watching BBC News with me, Ben Brown, here in Downing Street. As the new Prime Minister, Rishi Sunak, promises to fix the economic mess that the country is in. Mr Sunak is now in number 10 Downing Street after being formally appointed by the King this morning and he's been making his first few appointments to his new government. I will uh, unite our country, not with words, but with action. I will work day in and day out to deliver for you. Well, the first announcement of his new cabinet was Jeremy Hunt, who stays on in the post as Chancellor of the Exchequer. It's been a very, very busy afternoon here in Downing Street uh, with a host of appointments. Dominic Raab is back as Justice Secretary and Deputy Prime Minister. James Cleverley stays on as Foreign Secretary. Ben Wallace stays on as Defence Secretary. And Michael Gove looks like he's going to return to the government. Grant Shapps, we are hearing in the last couple of minutes, has been confirmed as Business Secretary. Grant Shapps, of course, a big supporter of Rishi Sunak. Do stay with us here in Downing Street for all the very latest appointments as they come in in the next few minutes. Hello and welcome to Downing Street, where it's been another day of uh, pretty intense political drama. The new Prime Minister, Rishi Sunak, has started assembling his brand new cabinet with a number of appointments into the very top jobs in government. Let's just run you through what we know so far. Jeremy Hunt, who took over as Chancellor of the Exchequer after Kwasi Kwarteng was sacked following all the fallout from that mini-budget last month, Jeremy Hunt remains in post at the Treasury, so he keeps his job there. Dominic Raab is back in the government, a key supporter of Rishi Sunak. He's back as Justice Secretary and reappointed Deputy Prime Minister. James Cleverley, who was made Foreign Secretary by Liz Truss, remains as Foreign Secretary. Ben Wallace remains as Defence Secretary at uh, the post he was appointed to by Boris Johnson. He could have run for the leadership, decided not to. And in the last few minutes, we are hearing that Suella Braverman has been reconfirmed as Home Secretary as well. And Grant Shapps, he becomes the new Business Secretary. So those big key appointments are coming into us thick and fast here in Damien Street. Let's turn to our political correspondent to try and make some sense of it all. Damien Grammaticus is here with me uh, in Downing Street. Um, Damien, there is a sense, to some extent, of stability and continuity, or that looks like, looks like what Rishi Sunak is trying to achieve, keeping people like James Cleverley in post, keeping people like Ben Wallace in post, keeping Jeremy Hunt in post. Yes, so there you see the top jobs, I think, the key priorities that Rishi Sunak was identifying in his speech that he gave. 